Elementary School presents its two project entitled The Builders, Bridging the Gap of Science Six Learners. Builders, Building Understanding and Innovation for Learners' Development, Enhancing Retention of Science Six. The pillars of the CI project, Dr. Nymfa D. Bongo, School Division Superintendent. Dr. Lia B. Apal, Assistant Schools Division Superintendent, Dr. Adeline C. Luares, SGOD Chief, Dr. Jaime Peroilan, CID Chief, Dr. Rahelio I. Garbo, Division CI Focal Person, Dr. Mirza J. Alvido, PSDS North Elementary, and Mrs. Maria Corazon and Mrs. Principal for a Pacman Elementary School. Our team is composed of the following, Mrs. Claudia V. Umbak, Process Owner, the same time Communication Officer, Mrs. Melba B. Deide, Group C. and Facilitator, Mrs. Cheryl E. Avinido, Documentation Officer, Mrs. Julemi Q. Bulhano, The Process Observer, and Mr. Michelle Escanada, The Scribe. Pacnan Elementary is a mega school with 3,920 learners and 116 nationally paid teachers and their efficient administrator. Where were we before? Science for Active Learning is a blend of processes and concepts that enable learners to learn as it relates to their everyday lives. As learners approach the new era, they are becoming more dependent on science and technology. Amidst this COVID-19 pandemic, the learners' education was compromised. The learners struggled in the adaptation of knowledge in the above-mentioned learning area. Through this study, they were provided with more opportunities and learning experiences that enhance their knowledge, skills, and attitudes to produce lifelong learners. Based on school monitoring evaluation and assessment results of the second rating school year 2021-2022 among the first in sections in grade 6, grade 6 watermelon got below 75% of the performance level in written works. After identifying our clientele, we conducted the following one-on-one -on -one interview using questionnaires, small group discussion following the IATF safety protocols, remedial instruction observation, voices of the learners, gan tagisod mangka ang answer sa science.
Walay magtudlok na ako sa balay. Dili ko ganahan magtuon. Dili ko pasabot sa akong bibasa o gyan si Ron Kenning. Walay oras sila si mama sa pagtudlok na ako. Kaya busy sila sa trabang. Nagsugo si mama o papa. Ay says of the parents, nga nung lesson man ang imong anak sa pag-answer sa science. Kukuwang ang mga examples na makita sa mundo. Pabor siya sugoon aron makakwarta. Maglisod o sabot sa mga termino sa science. Dile siya makadali-dali pangutana sa maestra. Mas ginahan ko siya magduwa ay sa magtuon. Dali, madisturbo sa kasika sa palibot. Voices of the teachers, ganun maglisod man ang bata sa pag-answer sa science. Maglisod sila sabot sa mga termino sa science. Dili sila mangutana, bisan wala sila kasagot. Daghan sa gabal sa ilang palibot. Walay interes sa pagkatol. Dali ra sila madisturbo sa pagtuon tungod sa gadget. Limitado ang mga gigamit ng mga materyales sa pagtudlo. A protest conducted by the CIA team last January 24, 2022 revealed that there were five whom three males and two females out of 39 learners or 12.82% got the lowest scores from the given assessment. The graph showed the greatest result of the five learners who got below the planning standards. Our focus problem statement based on practice conducted by the CI team, it was found out that five out of 39 or 12.82% of grade 6 watermelon learners did not master the competency in determining the distinguishing characteristics of vertebrates and invertebrates. Because of this, we did a root cause analysis and come up with the following for learning helpers. Huli mo tudlo na ko sa balay. For pupils learning, gali makadadali o pangutana sa maista. For instructional materials, limitado ang mga examples na makita sa modules. For time allotment, mas malingaw sila mo duo o games ilang gadgets. Based on the analysis, we found out that our priority valid cost was gali makadadali o pangutana sa maista. Our main objective was to enhance and improve the learner's mastery in determining the distinguishing characteristics of vertebrates and invertebrates. What did we do? For our pilot implementation highlights, we prepared the following remediation programs. In order to realize our objectives, we created a tutorial instruction program scheduled on February 14, 2022 to March 11, 2022 from 1 to 2 p.m. We also recruited learners from limited face-to-face -face lecture learners to be part of the Tutor Co. school Meet Co. Teachers also recruited to be part of the Teacher Co. Tutor Co. The learners were provided with enjoyable, interactive, and interesting activities using the CI made materials and downloaded short videos showing the classification of animals using PowerPoint presentation. Where are we now? Process was conducted by the CI team for five grade six with female learners who got below the planning standards last March 11, 2022. Out of five, four of them mastered already and was still needed for further mutation. Positive result was observed during the piloting period of this project. The ways and means of this project were proven effective, so there was a call of expansion. Rollout highlights. For the rollout, we have chosen grades to be Pado. Since this section got a second from the lowest section, based on the sec second rating is mere results. From the pretest conducted by the CI team last March 18, 2022, we found out that 5 out of 39 learners got below the planning standards, 2 of whom were males and 3 were females. The team followed the same processes done during the pilot phase. Post-test was conducted last April 18, 2022, revealed that 5 out of 39 learners got below the planning standards. All of them have already mastered the competency in determining the distinguishing characteristics of vertebrates and invertebrates. Rule out implementation phase highlights. We use the same strategies during the pilot phase. Learnings. As we approach the new millennium, we find ourselves becoming more dependent on science and technology. Science and technology, although distinct from each other, are closely intertwined as revealed by the new goals of science education. The program that we adopted proved to be worthwhile in determining the distinguishing characteristics on vertebrates and invertebrates. Being at par with games and other stuff in the internet serves as addition or input in the success of this program. Optimum learning was achieved because the materials were effective to the remedial learning process and parallel to the era, the so-called 21st century learners. Where do we go from here? Future plans. Follow up the pilot and roll out clientele during scheduled remedial time. Train our teachers in how to do the CI for school year 2022-2023 and encourage the teachers to use the CI materials found in a learner's resource center. 
before we part ways. Allow me to share with you this quote from Marie Curie. Nothing in life is to be feared. It is only to be understood. Now is the time to understand more that we may fear less. To God be all the glory.